What's going on guys? Welcome back. This is Felix Fingers, a Dreams Gamer. And this time around we have, check out the Bellevue. Let's check this one out. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more content like this from the Dreams platform. Here we go. The definition of insanity is doing the same thing over and over again, expecting a different result. Albert Einstein. New Year Gala, 1923 to 1924. Oh, we are in the past, folks. I have a bad feeling about this place, but I must uncover what tragedy befell the guests. It's creepy being in a, a hotel that seems like uh, is empty and you're there all alone investigating. I don't know, man. Oh, that's the elevator back there. I like the ambiance music, though. It does sound like, uh, not that I would know, but I guess music from the 1920s. Like elevator music. That door seems odd. What the hell is that? A vendomatic, a vending machine? That's pretty cool, man. That's interesting designing. Very cool. That was lightning. Oh, it's raining outside, guys. The details. Look at the water running down on the window. On the glass. Very good work, man. I like this. But it's too quiet, guys. You know, something's going to pop off soon. Look at that. The vents on the floor, too. Very excellently done. Yes. Really? All the doors are closed. take the elevator to the wrong floor I mean this looks really cool but uh look at the speaker <laughs> this looks really cool but I tried every door and for some reason none of them opened Did I miss? Oh, of course. What a fool. I didn't take the keys. <laughs> well, at least I gave you a little tour of the floor. Okay, so I'm assuming this is one. I gotta be so creepy. So this is our room. Oh, that sounds really good. The, the ambiance, guys, you already know. You can hear slight wind, the breeze. You can also hear the, uh, the, the 
thundering in the background and of course the rain this is really well done what's in the drawers what's in the drawers what's in the drawers what's this looks like a pretty expensive journal I should take a look hmm a single entry maybe I'll just borrow this for a bit Okay, that's like way too much to read. Guys, you already know, you can pause it if you'd like. But I actually want to play the game. Nothing in there. I should have checked that closet too. You see that written on the glass? What the hell is that? Is that? I guess that's our. But anyway, back to what I was saying. Do you see the glass? Shit. It looks like PIX3. Or TIX3? A watermark? I don't know, man. Toilet paper, always a good thing. In case you have to do caca. Can we open this here? Yeah. Wait, I didn't check. Is there something in the bottom there? No, just towels. That won't close. Oh. Shit. I wonder if that has to do with the numbers that I saw over on the, uh, on the mirror. You see them there? Well, not numbers, but... Hmm. I'm gonna have to look through that journal. The date. 29-12-1923. Let's try that. 29, 12, 1923. 29, 12. No, wait, what? No, because there's only one, two, th there's only 29, 12, 23. We could try that. Let's try 29, 12, 3. I said 29, right? <laughs> All right. Off to room seven we go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Turn off the lights before you leave.
Too bad you can't sprint. I mean, don't get me wrong, it's good exercise, but it's a game. What's this one? Five, four, six. I like the subtleness of the hint that was given because you still have to figure out what the hint is. So I kept reading and that 20 is what uh would help me get the answer. That 20 year to the day difference. Oh shit. Someone hung themselves here. Yep. Look at the lamp. I mean, the, the light is like detached from the ceiling, you see? And the chair they were standing on is kicked over. Guys, you already know, pause this. Because I will not read it until I really have to. If I get stuck again or something. Now that there's a note that we're supposed to have noticed. So I'm assuming running the hot water, maybe if we're allowed to do that, the steam will build up on the mirror and we could probably see what the note is. Before we go any further into what's in room seven. Let me make sure I don't need that message for anything. See, we need to have been able to sprint. This guy walks really slow. See that? Could we turn on? Yep. But I was able to see that earlier. Oh! Seven two nine one four four. Exit. So that was an exit. That was backwards. Exit. Seven two nine one four four. Interesting. Do, 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 do. Lucky there is music because this long ass walk in silence would have been a bit boring. Seven 
Key to room two. See, I like this. This is pretty cool. It's just the uh, it's long ass hallway, man. And you can't sprint. Nonetheless, I like this. This is pretty cool. Investigating what happened in this hotel. This is two? Yep. And I thought it was a a pretty cool um a pretty cool move on the creator to put the walkthrough in the journal. I think that was pretty cool. That was different. Very cool. Where the fishes go, man? Oh, the drawers. There's always some shit hidden in the drawers. Oh, and another uh, wall picture. Well, oh, I thought it had like a safe behind it. Let's check the drawers. Guys, you already know. Pause. And now on to the next escapade, the next room. But definitely, guys, go check this one out. Uh, if you like the whole detective work on this, thumbs up. This was really well done. Um, and creative with the whole walkthrough in the journal so you always carry it with you if you get stuck I think that was pretty cool um, but yeah this seems like it's going to be a, a long game because you've seen all the doors and I think we're only about to get into the third door so uh, you guys can go ahead and enjoy the rest of this but this was really good good job I enjoyed this pretty cool <laughs>